Okay, this is 1649 price. I'm gonna do an outside shot first of across the street and so forth. Um, price is kind of a busy street from time to time. It'll go in spurts. Got nothing across the street. Nothing beside you. On the other side, you have a bridge and a waterway and a vacant lot. But I believe the vacant lot is owned by the city, so nobody will ever be building beside it. But if you decide that you want to place an offer, I definitely would want to look into that a little bit more. But the way the guardrail is situated, it really gives you the impression that it's um, owned by the city. Okay, we're going to go up here. House is set vacant for a while. You got tall grass from just being recently cut. Roof looks in fairly good condition. You've got a privacy fence set up here for the back. House oh, definitely is going to need to be painted. Picture the back. can't get out the other side so go back it's definitely going to need a little bit of TLC from what I can see out here they've got landscaping timbers instead of curbing But it really wouldn't take much to clean that all up. Give me another shot here on the other side. A newer air conditioner. Okay. I'm going to head into the house. Screened in entryway. When you come in, you've got the kitchen off to the right. breakfast nook. Black appliances. Granite countertops.
your living room area. Do another shot of it this way. the kitchen and that doorway open over there goes to the garage here is the master tile single sink nice size shower tiled all the way up not a very big closet at all. Not at all. Master bedroom is not huge. But it's good size. As long as you don't put any real heavy furniture. Carpet. Appears to be in pretty good shape. Tile. Here's the other bedroom. Obviously it was a girl's bedroom. Ceiling's painted purple, the whole room is painted purple. And again, carpet. The other bathroom, it's like a Jack and Jill in between the two bedrooms. Has a tile all the way up painted ceilings. The door opens up from this into the other bedroom. This one doesn't have the newer carpet in it. Closet. See the tile into the other bathroom. And then the same tile here coming out of here back to the kitchen. That's your entry door to the house, and that's your breakfast nook where that light is. And you've got a nice sized pantry right off the kitchen. And again, this is your kitchen area. And here, the garage, it looks like they did a little enclosure, made another room, ran some ductwork. So, this is an enclosed room. There's really no lighting in it. There's your air handler. This is another room. So they made two more rooms out here for whatever reason. It would not be hard to convert it back to a garage. There's your hot water heater. And your laundry room is going to be out here. The door for the attic crawl space is missing. Some kind of little damage here to this tin cover. It's cosmetic, but it's just something that covers it up. And then this is your side entry to the garage. We'll go back through. And then do the uh, lanai in the pool. At this point, the pool does need some work done to it. It's discolored. 
the pool bath is off of the master. There's the tile. Nice size pool, but it definitely is going to need some work. Your lanai area. Nicely, nice covered lanai. The pool was not built at the same time the house was. I think the pool was an add-on. Because if you look here real close, you can see these. And that would have been part of the original screening. And then when they built the lanai, they took that off. But that's what was up there before. If you take that off, those are the marks that it's going to leave. Definitely needs a good cleaning. Needs some painting. Okay, that's going to do it for this house.